This is the Golden Retriever, uh, one of our most popular flies. We sell at Mossy Creek, and we're going to show you how to tie it. <clears throat> we use a 3x long, size 10 streamer hook, the 530 seconds gold bead. We're going to take 25 thousandths lead and wrap from the point of the hook all the way forward to the bead. Break it off and sink the lead underneath the bead. And we'll wrap our little tail around there so we don't have any waste. We use red flat waxed nylon um, for the entire fly. Used to use red floss. That was an extra material and an extra step. I'm going to start the thread right behind the lead and I'm going to go ahead and secure my thread, wrap all the way back to the barb of the hook where we're going to tie the tail in and then back forward and I'm going to build a small dam of thread behind the lead to keep it in place and then I'm going to wind back over the lead to secure it. Get rid of my tag there. Now for the tail we're going to use a piece of tan marabou. <clears throat> we are going to make sure that it is about a length and a quarter to a length and a half uh, the hook shank. So measure it there. We're going to switch hands, tie it in right on top of the barb of the hook and I'm going to wrap forward until I meet up with that lead and then remove my excess material and once you cover it the diameter of your body should be about the same from back to front. Now all we need to do is add some S-Taz for the body. This is standard size and what I'm going to do first is remove some of the material and expose the the thread there and S-Taz is directional and if you can see here the fibers are pointing down and we want to always have those fibers pointing down so the body will look the, the right way once we tie it on <clears throat> secure that little thread cover it all the way wrap your thread forward all the way to the the bead where we're going to ultimately tie it off and then we're going to wrap our S-Taz forward and what we're going to do is leave about an eighth of an inch between wraps on the way forward all the way to the bead that way that that red thread will kind of bleed through the fly once it gets wet. Tie off your S-Taz. Trim the material. Take a few more wraps right behind that gold bead. And then we're going to throw in a whip finish. Lock everything in place. And that's it. One of the most simple flies to tie and uh, very effective. We also fish it in pink, white, and in root beer.